Today I want to talk about time. We always seem to not have enough time, yet it's our most valuable resource. If we can use that time more efficiently, then it helps us in our, both our personal life and our business life. And in fact, it's a much better life balance if we learn the techniques to manage that time better. We spend much time learning so many other areas, but often don't take the time to, to really work out how to use that time in the best possible way. What I want to talk about today is just some ideas that we have that can really make a big difference. It's been proven over the years. Just a couple today I'll add to so for you, and then if you want to learn more, you can tune in later on and for a webinar I'm doing on time management. So today, I want to talk about the 10 of the time management techniques worth using. Now, one thing that we're finding nowadays is that is you really got to tame the phone, email, and social media. We can waste so much time on that, and I find it's much better to allocate a time during the day on your own default diary, which is a diary I'll talk about in our seminar, that allocates time for that, so you're not interrupted, or you're not spending too much time. I'm guilty of that too. I find that social media, whilst it's good for business, can also be a great time waster. The other thing I think it's important to look at too is to minimise meetings. Because so often we go to meetings and there's nothing achieved. I find with a meeting I go to, number one, I won't go unless there's a tight agenda. And two, there has to be an action sheet. I don't have time for minutes. All I really want to see is the action we've agreed on. And it should be what we agreed on, who's going to do it, most important, so it's allocated to a person. Sure, they can delegate or they can co-op members, but one person has to be responsible to make sure it happens. And then, of course, make sure you have a date. Set a time for that to be completed or reported back on. And that's all you really need for a meeting. What you've decided, who's responsible, by when. And that can really minimise your meeting time, but also, most importantly, the productivity of that meeting. Punctuality is so important too. There's nothing worse than waiting for people. But let people know that you're not prepared to wait because some people are just not good at it. And I'm sure you'll think in business and friends, they're always late and always have an excuse. But that's not really acceptable because their time is no more valuable than yours. So it's really important to, to be punctual yourself, but also expect that from others. Make and use lists are so important. I know that you know over the years that list making is so important and I get a real buzz out of what I've got to do during the day. And as I tick each item off as I do it, that in itself is motivational. And of course, use the theme of the frog, swallow, follow a frog each day. Um, with that process, of course, it means do the hardest thing first. And once you've done the hard thing, that's out of the way, something you may have worried about, and it actually motivates you to get on with the other, the other things in the day, which aren't anywhere near as bad and often far easier. So I think that you know, if you don't look at tight techniques to save your time, then you're not efficient. And it's far better in business because that time is so important to utilise it properly. And if you learn the techniques, it's going to make a big difference in your business and your private life. So if you'd like to learn more about time management, I've just touched on the surface today, but there's so many other areas too about delegation, about folders, about different things you can be doing that make such a big difference. You know, you know, block out your time in your diary so you've got time to work. You know, live off peak, you know, avoid getting, getting to times when you know it's going to be busy, you know, and uh, it's important to plan that through. So if you'd like to learn more about techniques to manage your time efficiently, often we know things, we don't actually do it. I find this call to action is really powerful. So get in touch with me, love to talk to you about it and improve and I promise you it won't be a waste of time. Thank you.